Hi. Welcome to Healthy Lifestyle. Subscribe to my channel for more quality videos. Curly hair often tebby coarse, unruly, and frizzy. Fortunately, it does not have to be this way. With proper care, curly hair can be soft, shiny, and beautiful. This article will show you how to tame your unruly mane into soft, sleek curls. Keep in mind that not all treatments will work for everyone, and that you may need to do some experimenting before finding one that's right for you. Washing and drying your hair properly. Know what shampoo and conditioner is good for curly hair. Try to get products that are made specifically for curly hair. They will contain extra nutrients that curly hair needs to look smooth, soft, and healthy. Here are some other things you should look for. Moisturizing or hydrating shampoos, conditioners add moisture back into your hair, making it look less frizzy and dry. Oils and butters, such as avocado oil and shea butter, also add moisture back into your this will help make it feel soft and smooth. Protein will help make your hair healthy, shiny, and strong. This will help reduce frizz. Further, avoid using products that contain silicones, sulfates, and probens. Silicones are plastics that are found in many styling products. They can only be removed by sulfates, which are harsh cleaning agents. Sulfates can make curly hair dry and frizzy. Probens are preservatives, and may be linked to cancer, it is best to avoid them altogether. Avoid using styling products with alcohol in them. Alcohol can make curly hair feel dry, and dry hair tends to look frizzy. Hairsprays, gels, and mousses all tend to contain alcohol. Read the ingredient label before purchasing any of these types of products. If something you cannot find anything without alcohol, try to find something where alcohol is towards the end of the ingredient list. Don't wash your hair every day. Curly hair does not produce as many natural oils as other types of hair, so tends to get dry and frizzy easily. Washing your hair every day will remove all of those helpful oils. Instead, try to wash your hair two to three times a week. If you have very dry hair, you may want to reduce that to once a week. Apply shampoo to the roots and work your way down. There should be hardly any shampoo on the ends of your hair. Shampoo can buy drying, and the ends of your hair are the most fragile. Apply conditioner to the end. Work your way up. There should be hardly any conditioner on the roots of your hair. Conditioner weighs your hair down. It may also make the roots more greasy. Let the conditioner sit for 2-3 to three minutes, or longer if the label says to. Do. Try to let your hair air dry, and avoid using a towel. Heat can make curly hair frizzy, and the coarse texture of most towels can snag and tear the delicate hairs. Instead, allow your hair to air dry. If you must towel dry it, try blotting it with a microfiber cloth instead. A microfiber cloth is soft, so it won't snag your hair. It is also absorbent, so it will soak up the excess moisture. Try using a diffuser or hooded dryer to dry your hair. Heat can damage curly hair and make it frizzy. If you have to blow dry your hair, try attaching a diffuser to your hair dryer. You will disperse the heat and make it less intense. This will prevent tangles and frizz. You can also use a hooded dryer, this works great for kinky or textured hair. Be sure to spray your hair down with a heat protection spray before using a diffuser. Thanks for watching. I hope you like my video. Please subscribe to my channel for more quality videos.